Springtime was nearing on the island of Sodor, and as the flowers were about to be blooming into the fields, a small chill of winter was still in the air. The engines were their usual busy selves, transporting passengers and freight to their destinations on the first few days of the new year. This means more trucks were left in the yard to be shunted, and since that Donald and Douglas were away on the Little Western, the fat controller had asked Toby to shunt trucks in the yards. Toby trundled away from Thomas's branch line and went on his way to Napford. I don't mind a bit, he said to himself as he was trundling away towards the yards. Shutting trucks on the main line can be taking trucks to the quarry. Besides, it's a nice change of scenery, that is. I've been shutting trucks on the main line since working at the harbour on the mainland. He was surprised to see that none of the other engines are still in their sheds. Hmm, shame's quiet here than what I thought, he said. Most of the engines went on their way with their own work. Happy New Year, Toby. Can't stop the chat. The express cannot be late. Cheerio, Toby. But the big blue engine was cross when he didn't see his coaches on the platform. Where are my coaches? said Gordon crossly. As Toby was shunting in the yards, one of the workmen came up to him and his driver. Gordon needs his coaches right away. Please shunt them towards him. Right, said his driver. What are the coaches started? Near the tracks, said the workman. So Toby collected the coaches and went on his way to the big station. But Gordon was still cross. Come on, come on, come on, I'm going to be late. So Toby gently buffered up the coaches towards Gordon. and a shunter coupled them up to Gordon's tender. <whistles> Toby was surprised that Gordon was pulling out of the station already, with him coupled behind. Help! he shouted. But Toby's driver and fireman were unsuccessful to catch up to him. Toby was now on the main line. Gordon, stop! Stop! Please, stop! shouted Toby. At last, they stopped at Crosby Station.
As some of Gordon's passengers were getting off, one noticed Toby. Guard, there's an engine at the back of your train. Oh, crumbs, said the guard, and he went off to tell Gordon's crew. And as he did, the shunter uncoupled Toby from the brake coach, and Gordon's driver was to place him in a siding. Gordon puffed away out of the station, feeling rather foolish of what he had done. Later, Toby's crew arrived on board James's stopping train. And after a nice long drink, they head their way back to Napa. Toby was resting at the mainline sheds, as Donald and Douglas are still needed on the Little Western. Gordon arrived back from his last train. He still felt foolish from this morning. I am sorry, Toby, said Gordon. It's okay, Gordon. It was a nice change of scenery with the Express. And all the engines laughed. 